right, everybody, welcome back. We are on level seven of lesson 13, and I have good news for you and bad news for you. The good news is, is that I'm gonna go through and figure out how to make this work. The bad news is, is that I'm not going to share my screen while I do that because this is an assessment level, and I know that because of the purple check mark right here. So we're gonna go through and read the instructions. I'm gonna read the rubric. We're gonna look, or we're gonna talk about some tips and tricks, and then I'm going to let you give this a try because that's what an assessment is. I wanna see how well you can do this. All right, so um, let's start with the instructions. We're gonna match the image. So this image over here is what we're trying to get. This is what we have right now. Um, Zoe is trying to style her web page to match the layout in the image to the right. Can you help her? So do this. Notice the order, size, alignment, and spacing of the items in the example image. Adjust the order of the items to match the example. Identify any items that are aligned differently from others within the container and apply align self to achieve the same effect. Determine which items need to be larger than others and apply flex grow to these items. Consider their proportion in the example image. Make sure you adjust the preview window to see if you've matched the image example. Uh, don't forget to refer back to your Flexbox Children Cheat Sheet, this one right here, whenever you need. You can also click on help and tips right here and it's also right here. So again, if you've lost uh, the resource and it slipped mysteriously out of your binder, um, you still have access to it right there. Uh, let's talk about the rubric. And, I, and um, I'm also gonna give you a couple of things that I've noticed uh, students getting or str struggling with. So rubric, no evidence. Let's start with the bad stuff. So no evidence. There are no order, aligned self, or flex score properties added for child paragraphs or images in order to match the image in the instructions. Now, I've seen students who went through and just manually went in here and reordered the pictures. That is not what it's asking you to do. Don't do that. All right? It's asking you to actually use the order tag. All right? Um, limited evidence, so we're going to close that one. We, we don't want to see that. Limited evidence, added either order, align self, or flex scroll properties to child paragraphs and or images, but not all of the needed properties to match the image in the instructions. So you got some of it done, but not all of it. That's limited. All right. Convincing evidence, added order, align self, and flex scroll properties to child paragraphs and images, but the result does not exactly match the image to the instructions. So you want to be careful with that. Um, I will say that one of the biggest things that I have seen students uh, mess up on is, again, they, they just tried to manually put the planets in order instead of using um, order. But the other one that I've seen is this one right here, where this is a container, this is a container, and this is a container. Um, and they'll do really crazy numbers for this, like 30, uh, which is not what you're supposed to do. Like that, don't, think smaller, guys. Um, so um, that's a hint that I'll give for the New Horizons part. Um, because in the end, you want it to look like this up here. All right. Um, so rubric, last one but not least, where your 100% extensive evidence added an order property to child paragraphs and images to match the layout of the image in the instructions, added an aligned self property to paragraphs to match the image in the instructions, added a flex score property to paragraphs to match the image in the instructions. So you've got everything, it all works, it looks correct, uh, you earn your 100. All right, so um, with that, I will hush and let you give this a try. Um, again, it is an assessment level, so I'm not going to walk you through it, but hopefully you are prepared and ready to tackle this, and I will see you on the other side. All right, let's do it. <laughs> 